Hey everyone, in this video we are going to see how we can install the Podman, the alternative of the Docker. So basically you have to search on Google the same thing and you will come up on the first link. So this is the official documentation of the Podman. So we, you are going to scroll way down to the Ubuntu, okay, so as we are going to install on the Ubuntu. So you have to just simply update it or just copy this command and open up a new terminal. Let me just increase the font size so that it will be visible to you. Just paste it, okay. You need to enter the password of your user so it will first update your system and then it will go for the installation of the power month so once it's done i will be back with you okay so till then we'll just wait okay so we have got some issue i guess so let's fix it what it is so let us clear the screen and uh, if we just remove iphone why Do not get a lock okay update is it updating perfectly fine or not okay it's done okay so we'll just look for this error why we are getting so Gemini what it is saying Okay, if any active is running, then in that case we have to. Okay. Let me just exit all the terminals. I'll just right click and quit to Windows. Now let's do. Okay, so two are the root process. This is the underscore apt process. Okay, so what it is saying me to do check for active apt dbkg process. You can find any other. Okay, we can remove the log files if you are confident that no critical package management operation in progress. Okay, fine then i can just go with uh, what lip tpkg and then here we have the log and log front end yes yes and we have to do it in sudo so sudo rm log front end and the log okay we are good to go now so let me just uh, again try to install so update is done already so let's paste it okay it's done so now you can see my okay so bandhu is only installing So we'll just wait until it's done okay so it's done we can check the version now for podman so podman version you can see here and now you can use the same podman images then podman ps all those commands whatever the docker commands you know the same commands you can use for the podman as well so we face the fuse issue in starting so in this way you just resolve it and if you are facing the same otherwise you can use the same documentation using the sudo apt get install okay so that's it for this video and i will see you in the next one thanks so much for watching